as you can probably see from the clips there, she's a very, very special young lady. Gabriella is really, truly quite remarkable. If it wasn't for the work that Gabriella does, many underprivileged children would not have an opportunity to make something of themselves. And it's sport that gives them that routine and the discipline that helps them find their way. Now, Gabriella, you have an extremely busy life. In between your studies, you're about to start university. You also hold down a part-time job. You play rugby, you play football, you train some youngsters at rugby as well. And you work with some amazing kids. Just tell us a little bit about what you do. Well, I work with all different sorts of children. Those that come from well-established backgrounds, those that are less fortunate, but they really are, really are a pleasure to work with. I really do enjoy myself. And they obviously enjoy working with you. And you act, I guess, as a mentor to some of these kids from the areas that you grew up in around London. Yeah, I just like a Londoner like David Beckham. It's just, I'm just really happy to be here. <laughs> it takes a special girl, though, doesn't it? Not, not only to come up here and, and have to speak in front of an awful lot of people, to be joined by a man like David Beckham, and to have helped these kids as well. She really is an inspiration to a lot of young people out there to show that it is possible. Yeah, like I said before, you know, she's such a special young lady. You know, she's got, you know, athletic ability, you know, the things that she does, you know, and has done from such a young age, you know, playing football from the age of five upwards and the other sports that she's involved in. But what's special about her is, yes, she's got great ability within herself and yes, she's achieved so much for herself, but what she does for others, that's a special part of why she's here today and it's one of the reasons why she's my nomination for this because she's a special lady that does so much for, for many other people and that is a special part of what she's all about. Can I just say thank you to everyone that's helped me, my rugby coaches, my family, Wooden Spoon and David Beckham because I wouldn't be here and especially the children because I'm just truly grateful to be here right now.